Hello everyone, this is Ryan here, and today I'm going to be doing another interview, and this is with a builder this time, so if you'd like to introduce yourself, that'd be, uh, that'd be awesome. Um, hey, my name's Cousins, and, well, my in real life name is Luke, I guess you can call me, and yeah, I'm the builder of Mindblocks. Alright, so my first question is pretty simple, uh, when did you first apply for builder, and how long have you been builder? Uh, I think I applied possibly two weeks ago, so not that long ago, um, and I've only been built up for about a week and a bit, so yeah, I'm pretty new. Yeah, so in that last week and a bit, how long, uh, or how have you enjoyed being on the staff team, or builder team? <laughs> it's, um, it's pretty fun actually. Um, there's been a lot of people that I've met, and honestly the build team are a cool group of people, so yeah. So do you know, do you know off the top of your head how many people are, are on the build team? Uh, I I'm not entirely sure of the exact number, but I'm gonna guess possibly 13 maybe. Okay, um, so can you kind of explain your application process and like how, how long it took for you to get accepted once you applied? Um, yes, so first of all you obviously apply on these forms and then it takes possibly about a week or two to be accepted into the next stage which is the trial stage and after that you have a month to show off your builds and build I'm not sure how in detail I can go but builds about the server build maps and things so and then after that no, no, sorry, sorry go ahead continue um, so after that, what happens is the build team, applications team, will then look over all your builds and what you've done, and then um, they just accept you or deny you, and then you have to wait another two weeks to apply, I believe. So uh, are you allowed to tell uh, or tell the community what maps you have currently or you have been a part of building? Um, I'm not allowed to say, but what I can say is I currently don't have any maps on the server, but I am currently building some right now. Okay. So. Uh, so do you, so what, what kind of, like, commands and stuff do you get as a builder? Like, do you get, like, world editing and all that stuff? Um, in, so we don't actually get any commands on this server. We do get some perks, though being like particle effects, some cool costumes and all that, yeah. but we do get some permissions on building, yeah. Okay, and so when you guys build, do you guys have like your own separate Mindplex server where you guys build on? Um, yeah, we do, and first of all, I'm not allowed to give out the IP or anything, so don't go asking. <laughs> um, but yeah, we each have our own little area to build, and we can either build together or build alone or separately so yeah and who and do you have like a mentor as a builder or is there someone that that like looks after you um no not exactly but people do look after you a bit so what happens is once you build your maps people can give feedback they can tell you some problems with your maps and all you have to do is just fix them okay. so that's all yeah that, that's uh that's that's a good system um yeah so do you feel that you get any extra attention being a builder on the server um, I will admit, I have been in a couple games, and a couple people have um, said hello to me and asked me a couple questions, but yeah, that's about all. And how many applications did it take before you were accepted? Um, that was actually my first ever application on Builder, so it was my first try, which I'm happy about. And how many hours a day, or how much time would you say you spend building on the server versus playing on the server? I think probably I think I play on the server a bit more than I do build, but I'm probably going to change that eventually because of like in real life things that go yeah. on. So you know. So do you enjoy being a builder? And uh, like, would you say that that's more fun for you than actually playing on the server? I mean, building, I will admit, is pretty fun for me. I'm not sure about other people, because it can be frustrating for them, I will admit. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, if you if you enjoy it, then I will say continue doing it, because it is pretty fun. But I don't know what to say is better, playing on the silver or building. I think it's probably about equal. All right. 
Uh, and for my last question, uh, any, do you have any advice for people who would like to become a builder on Mindplex about their application or their portfolio or anything like that? Uh, I guess with, with the application, make sure you show everything that you've done. Even if you don't like it, it just shows that you can have potential to become something bigger. And just be detailed in what you say and be yourself. All right, awesome. Well, thank you so much for this interview. This has been a pleasure, and thank you for agreeing to do this. We kind of got a little more insight into the build team because I feel like it's not as talked about as you know some of the some of the other teams on the server. So that's pretty awesome to get a little insight on that. And I wanted to thank everyone for watching this video, and I hope you guys will come back for the next video. Thanks again.